Okay, this is just a quick vlog to let you know how I've been doing since I've been discharged from the mental health team, the secondary services. Um, I'm not doing great really, I thought I was doing okay, but I'm getting really paranoid about friends again, like thinking that they don't really like me and they're just replying to me to be polite and stuff. And I keep thinking if they don't reply to me for ages and they don't really like me that I'm just annoying them. So it mean it makes me um, not want to talk to people because I feel like I'm just going to annoy them. And when I'm feeling this bad it's like I just want to isolate myself from everyone so I guess I am. I've been trying. I mean... Um, I've got a care plan now and it's got um, what I do if I feel okay, what I do if I feel that things are starting to get worse and what I do if, thing, if like I'm in crisis and if I'm okay-ish then um, I'm to use my distraction techniques like gaming, talking to friends, watching movies or TV, just things to keep my mind on, off how I'm feeling. Um, when I'm not feeling so good, it says call the mental health team and they'll remind me to use my distraction techniques and they might give me advice on what to do otherwise. And um, if I'm in crisis, then to ring them or ring the out of hours team. So I suppose that's kind of like the crisis team. And hopefully I'll get re referred to secondary services and I'll um, either get allocated a CPN, a nurse again, and or. I'll get a medication review with the psychiatrist and um, they've coded the those three things as um, green, amber and red so like red alert sort of thing and all that um, I don't know where I am though maybe I'm in amber like sometimes I feel like I'm moving from amber to red I'm like sort of in the middle of that but um, I know that they only do short term help really and it's hard to pinpoint what kind of help I need I just want to feel better I don't want to feel so paranoid and awful about myself um, oh, I'm trying to get my words out at the moment I'm I'm really tired but I just feel awful so I don't think I'm going to sleep much. I haven't been sleeping very well recently anyway. And the thought of ringing up to talk to the talk to mental health team, it just, it's really nerve wracking because I find it very hard to really open up and on the phone I prefer to just kind of say what I need to say get whatever it needs whatever needs doing done and that's it so like if I need to um, order a prescription book an appointment something like that I know what to expect so I can just bring up get it done and that's it because I find it I mean I think I have social anxiety so I find it difficult to talk to people on the phone and stuff to worry about how I come across and I don't want any unexpected questions because I don't like being silent for ages if I don't know the answer. Um, anyway, I'm, I'm digressing again. Um, what was I saying? So yeah, I mean I have to ring up the mental health team I suppose when I'm feeling like this that's really what I should be doing. But um, I just can't get up the courage to do it so rather than um, so I'm kind of at a loss of what to do 
Um, I'm venting on Twitter. I say the odd thing on Facebook, but I don't know, it's just the way it is. Like, it's easier to talk about how you really feel on Twitter than on Facebook because you're sort of expected to talk about how grateful you are for things and how everything's amazing and that on Facebook because you're sort of seen as, you know, oversharing if you really talk about how you feel, you know? Anyway, um... It's not the most positive update, I'm afraid, but this is how things are at the moment, and any advice would be great. If not, fair enough. Um, but yeah, I noticed that I hadn't posted a video in a while, so this is how I am now at this point, and... If I get up the courage to ring the mental health team or if I feel differently soon or something, then I'll let you know. So, um, I'll say goodbye for now and hopefully I'll vlog again soon.